So you've got a wireless lav mic and you wanna now connect that to the Rodecaster Pro 2. Well, it is quite simple. You're gonna need, of course, a wireless lav uh, microphone or wireless system. And on this one, I've got the Rode Wireless Go 2. And now I've got two transmitters and one receiver, but I'm just gonna show you using the single transmitter. Uh, and then this is the receiver. And then you need the cable that comes with the Rode. Now this is the TRS cable. So you can see here uh, that it's got two black rings, not three rings, but two black rings. That is essentially TRS. The one with the three black rings is TRRS, and that's to connect mobile devices or connect this to mobile devices. But since this is not a mobile device, you only need this red cable that has the two black rings on it. Uh, now, because this here is a three and a half millimeter uh, jack, you need a converter as well. So this converts this three and a half millimeter over to a quarter inch that fits onto the back. So I'm going to connect this to here, just like that. And then I'm going to go to the front of the unit and I'm gonna plug this into port number two. So you can see it goes right into the middle of this XLR combo jack. So this is a line input device now. And on the other end of this red cable, I'm going to connect the receiver. Okay, so remember it's the receiver because you're transmitting signals and coming in, it's receiving, or the Rodecaster Pro is receiving it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the receiver end, which is the one with the LED lights on it. And I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna plug the one end or the other end of this red cable into the receiver. So I'm just gonna leave that over here so you can see what it, that is now. Uh, so that's over there. And the transmitter is now powered on as well. So you can see it's got the two lights. One is for the connection, and then the other one is for the battery level. So that is now there. So I'm just gonna, sorry if I'm scratching the microphone, but now I'm just gonna click, put that onto my shirt, and I'm gonna show you how to connect the, uh, or have the proper settings on the Rode Wireless Go 2. So remember that's now on uh, channel number two, or port number two on the back. So now I'm gonna go into channel two, remember faders all the way down to the bottom, click on that, and I'm gonna select line in. Now you can go ahead and select instrument or whatever you want. However, remember these are just presets. You do not need to send phantom power to this because it's a, it's a quarter inch jack. There's no power that's gonna be transmitted through that. So line in or instrument, but typically this is just gonna be using line in. So we're gonna hit line in. Now you can see all of a sudden you can see the actual meters or the volume meters moving up a little bit. And if I, if I hit the microphone on the top, scratch it, you can see that the volume goes up. So I need to add extra gain because if I change this, and I'm speaking now on this microphone, it sounds like I'm really far away because there's not enough gain. But if I start to increase the gain on this, you can see that my voice is now getting stronger and stronger. And I think it's around 38 decibels of gain, is around 38 decibels of gain, which is what I need in order to be able to get this unit to sound good. So now you can hear me and I'm coming solely on channel two, which is the wireless go. And so I can go ahead and move around and you know talk and do everything that I want to, and the meter is going to work. So because you can see here channel two, you're listening to the wireless lav go. Now, you may need a lavalier microphone or you may have a lavalier microphone. So instead of clipping this big box on your shirt, you may want to, instead of doing that, you may wanna just use a lavalier mic. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, use this Rode lavalier microphone here. So you can see here, this is the tiny microphone end and this is the 1 8 inch jack. That jack goes into the top of the uh, transmitter and that can be now clipped to my pants. So I'm gonna clip that on my pants and this typically is going to be the exact same place. So it's gonna be around here. Now I don't have the clip on mine right now so you're not gonna see that. I'm just gonna hold it and pretend that this is where it's gonna go. So let me just switch over. And now this is me using the lavalier mic on the Rode Wireless Go. So the Rode Wireless Go is attached to my pants here and this is what it's going to be like using this device on the Rodecaster Pro 2. When you're all set and done, just remember, change the fader, go all the way down to the bottom, and then you can power off your microphones. Psst, did you know that you could have had access to this entire Rodecaster Pro 2 series first, like a month ago?
but you missed out because you weren't on my streaming platform called Nebula. And it's not just me, it is all my creator friends. We are putting an amazing amount of content on Nebula. Let me show you. You can see all the latest videos from all the creators on this platform. Hey, look, Apos Fox. And you get original content that isn't even uploaded to YouTube from your favorite creators. You've got Nebula first, extended versions, maybe bloopers or extra additional information that you don't get on YouTube. Nebula first, things that are exclusive, early access on this platform. There's so much great stuff here. And here's the cool thing. Usually Nebula is $50, but with my exclusive link, it actually goes down to $333 a month for you. So you can find that link in the description.